All right, welcome back. Got some charcoal fired up from Royal Oak. Love that lump charcoal. Today we're going to be doing some chuck roasts. I got two here, and I'm going to be using the standard mustard, salt, pepper, garlic. And I'm going to be making some poor man's burnt ends today. Get them all seasoned up. Probably shouldn't have used parchment paper. That was a pain in the butt. All right, got the meat on the grill. And I have it set about 270. It's been about two hours. We're gonna check these things out here. Thermometer says they're about 160, 162. We'll get them wrapped in some foil here shortly. But yeah, they're starting to get some color to them. Probably let them go just a little bit longer. They sure are starting to look good though. All right, they've stalled out at about 165 degrees. And I'm gonna use some of this. I used a quarter cup of beef stock and a quarter cup of barbecue sauce for the small one. Doing one barbecue, one original. Now that they're wrapped up and good to go, we'll get the probes stuffed back in them and we'll be back in an hour or so. All right, these are done. Got a decent little smoke ring for the amount of time that they've been on there. Gonna cut them up into about one inch cubes. Some of the pieces you can cut in half. Just, you know, make whatever size you really want. All right, now that I got them cut up, I'll put them back into the juices. And I also made some beef stock mixed a little bit of salt, pepper, garlic, and I'll get the meat all covered in that, and we'll start with the barbecue one. Really kind of curious about this one. I've never made these before. And again, we'll cut it up into one inch pieces. And I picked up this Primal Kitchen Classic Barbecue. It's a no sugar added barbecue sauce. It was a little bland for my taste, but I figured I'd try it out. I usually make my own sauce. Now that they're all tossed in the sauces, I'm gonna put them back on the acorn. Right now I have the acorn sitting at about 350 degrees. I'm gonna let it ramp up gradually to about 375 to 400 degrees for this. They're gonna be sitting on this grill for probably about 25, 30 minutes. All right, it's been about a half hour. I'm gonna open these up and see what they look like. Oh yeah, they're starting to get a little crispiness to them, frying in their own juices. And we'll get them pulled off here very soon. And here's the finished product. They got some really nice color to them, some nice texture. And they smell delicious. And this is Poor Man's Burn Ends, made out of some chuck roast. First time ever doing it, and it was definitely worth it.